I'm Councillor Lorna Fielker and I'm the leader of Southampton City Council. It's immense honour and privilege to be elected to this role by my fellow councillors and I'm really looking forward to building on the work of Councillor Satvir Corps in order to make this a really great city for people to grow and thrive. And I'm looking forward to working with my fellow cabinet members, with council officers, city partners and community leaders in order to deliver that for our residents and our businesses. My main priority is dealing with the financial challenges that we have at the moment and I'm fully committed to ensuring that we deliver a sustainable modern council, delivering the valuable services that we can within the reduced budgets that we have. But alongside that I'm really ambitious for Southampton, we need to look to grow our local economy in a way that works for local residents and local businesses. We want to have good jobs and we want to encourage people to come and visit Southampton. Additionally, something that I think is really important is housing. A secure and stable home is not a luxury, it's an absolute essential. We know that housing and good housing is, produces those outcomes that enable people to grow and thrive and to live good, long, healthy lives. So I'm working to deliver a really strong, affordable housing programme over the coming years. And finally, it's really important to talk about the climate and change assembly that's been taking place in Southampton over the past few months. We brought together a really broad range of views and opinions from all sides of that argument, and they've been talking about how we address climate change and transport in the city. And the outcome of that work will really help to inform the work we do in the future. I'm really grateful to all the messages of support I've had from so many people since becoming leader of the council. It's such an honour and a privilege and I really intend to work very hard to deliver for you and I'm looking forward to getting out in the community and meeting people over the coming months.